instructional of all of the steps and how they move, and then we'll go over the sequence of it. So one of them is a twist. So your right hand, the right foot is beveled, arms are flexed on the side, and your hip is going to twist. So my right foot is beveled, and it is on the ball of my foot. Left foot is flat behind me. So my right hip is going to twist from my left hip, and it's going to twist up. So I only see the one hip up, and it's going to sit back down. It's going to go up, down, up, down. I'm going to hit it pretty sharp, and my arms are going to go from left to right. So it's going to go twist, and twist, and twist. So again, my hip is going up slowly, uh, fast. And then my arms are going from left to right, it's kind of cutting in the air. So twist, twist. And then my arms just come across to the sides of me. And I'm on the balls of my feet, just twisting side to side and playing with the level. So I'm going down and up and down and up. So that's one part. Every time you hear the chorus, it's going to go one and two and three and four, then one, two, three, then low, two, three, and high, two, three, and low, two, three, and high, two, three. So I'm literally swiveling my hips in on the balls of my feet. Um, that's that moment. Okay, and then there is a uh, right leg. My right leg is going to go from the ball of my foot. It's going to come up, down, up, down. I'm going to get. I'm going to bend my left leg and go, uh, get low to the ground. And both my hands are kind of going to uh, act like they're picking up my foot and twisting it up. So it's going one and two and three and four. We do that eight times. Then we switch the leg. Same exact thing on the left leg. Two. Three, you can swing your hips with it. Five, six, seven, eight. Now, I'm facing the right side. My arms are gonna go forward, kind of like they're covering a door. And then they're gonna open. And then they're gonna cover. And then they're gonna open. Um, when I cover, um, my hips are going away. When I open, my hips go forward. And then away. And then forward and then away. So I do this eight times. I'm going one and two and three and four and five and six and seven and switch. To the left, I'm only doing it four times. Going one and two, three and four. So I'm, what I'm doing is I'm going right, left, right, left. And my hip goes, my pelvic goes up almost like I'm doing crunch and then I'm releasing and I'm doing crunch and then I'm releasing. So I do that eight times to the right four times to the left, and then I'm doing apple twists, because I call them apple twists because I imagine tall trees, one on this side, one on this side, and I reach for apples. They're tall, that's why my arms need to be straight. And then I twist those apples in my arms and bring them into imaginary buckets on my shoulders. So these are called apple twists. So you want to get used to this apple twisting. And this is in a V shape, but we're going to do it in an L shape, going one, two, three, Four. As we do that, we're also doing um, an up and down step, which is toe flat, toe flat. If you want instructional for just up and down st uh, step, send me an email, I'll, I'll send you that instructional. So it goes to the left. One, two, three, four. It goes around four. And then the chorus starts again. Twist, twist, twist. And then slow twist all the way to the ground, all the way up. Um, then this part repeats, that sequence repeats, and the left sequence repeats. Um, then this whole section, eight of these to the right, four to the left, around for four, and then the twist repeat. Now the next part is a chest pump. Your legs are in second position, which just means your feet are under your shoulders and apart. And your palms are flat, they're going under your shoulders and they're pumping. One, two, hip. Hip, your chest, your shoulder blades are trying to touch in the back and then go forward. So it's going chest pump, chest pump, hip, hip, chest pump, chest pump. This is for an eight count. Five, six, seven, eight. You're doing um, sways. So your fingers are outlining your hips and you're walking and you're, you're just moving your hips side to side as you walk to the right and go in a circle. So that's five, six.
six, seven, eight, and then the chorus starts again, and then we're done. So that that is this is literally your steps. Rewind this. If you're watching it on YouTube, you can um, play it on your computer in slow motion and get each step, and then review it with the um, dance part. Have fun.